కోటింగ్ ఫెయిల్యూర్స్ అండ్ డిఫెక్ట్స్ ఓవర్ యూ పార్ట్ టూ లక్షర్ బై డాక్టర్ జి సుబ్రహ్మణ్యన్ చీఫ్ సైంటిస్ట్ రిటైర్డ్ సిఎస్ఐఆర్ సెంట్రల్ ఎలక్ట్రోకెమికల్ రిసర్చ్ ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ ప్రేల్యూడ్ ఇన్ మై ప్రీవియస్ లెక్చర్ కోటింగ్ ఫెయిల్యూర్స్ అండ్ డిఫెక్ట్స్ ఓవర్ యూ పార్ట్ వన్ డీటైల్డ్ బ్రీఫింగ్ వాజ్ గివన్ అబౌట్ ట్వంటీ వన్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ కోటింగ్ ఫెయిల్యూర్స్ అండ్ డిఫెక్ట్స్ కమెన్సింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ అబ్రేషన్ టు గ్రీనింగ్ in the order of alphabet a to g in the present lecture quoting failures and defects overview part 2 detailed briefing would be given about another 21 types of quoting failures and defects commencing from heat damage to wrinkling in the order of alphabet h to w the majority of paint and coating related failures can be attributed to six primary causes these causes are as follows import improper surface preparation two improper coating selection three improper application four improper drying curing and over coating times five lack of protection against water and aqueous systems six mechanical damage there are innumerable possible failure modes which can result from these primary causes the failure modes are divided into three general categories which are as follows formulation related failures substrate related failures physical defect related failures heat damage the figure on the top left side gives you picturesque view of this heat damage discoloration detachment or blistering and general degradation of paint film probable causes effect of high temperature often applied to the reverse side of a steel plate from burning welding or fire prevention ensure that all welding burning is completed prior to painting impact damage this has been picturesquely described on the image top of left side of, of the slide cracks that radiate from a point of impact probable causes impact damage to a relatively brittle coating often seen on glass fiber reinforced plastics also occurs when the steel is deformed by impact prevention prevent impact damage intercoat contamination this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the image cracks that radiate from a point of impact probable causes the contamination could be present due to inadequate washing down salts from weathering of shop primer or deposits from nearby operations prevention carefully inspect and test the surface before paint application and wash down with fresh water if required mud cracking this defect has been pictorially depicted on the image top left side the dried paint film has the appearance of a dried out mud flat the cracks appear as a network that can vary in size and amount probable causes generally over application of heavily pigmented primers such as inorganic zinc silicates or water based coatings although can occur with other over thick systems prevention apply only the recommended coating thickness use recommended application techniques with suitably formulated products orange peeling this defect has been pictorially depicted on the image top left side a uniform pock marked appearance in particular of a spray applied coating in which the surface of the paint film resembles the skin of an orange probable causes failure of the paint film to flow out usually caused by poor application techniques incorrect solvent blend or too high thixotropy 
prevention use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products peeling this damage has been this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the image similar to flaking although peeling tends to be associated with soft and pliable fresh coatings that can be pulled away from or spontaneously flake away from the substrate or from between coats due to loss of adhesion probable causes peeling is a reduction in bond strength of the paint film due to contamination or incompatibility of coats prevention use correct coating system and specification apply to clean and uncontaminated surfaces pin holes this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the image the formation of minute holes in the wet paint film during application and drying due to air or gas bubbles that burst giving rise to small craters or holes that fail to collapse before the film has set probable causes solvent or air entrapment within the paint film a common problem when coating porous substrates such as zinc filled primers zinc silicates and metal sprayed coatings pin holes can also be caused by incorrect spray application or incorrect solvent blend prevention use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products correct solvent blends and environmental conditions check spray equipment and distance of spray gun from the surface apply a mist coat rippled coating this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide a rippled effect on the surface of the paint probable causes strong wind blowing across the surface of the wet paint causes it to ripple where this occurs on the underside the ripples can hang down in the form of small stalactites can also be caused by poor application techniques prevention do not apply paint under unfavorable conditions use correct application equipment and workmanship runs this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide a narrow downward movement of a coat of paint often apparent from accumulation of excessive quantities of paint at irregularities such as cracks and holes where the paint continues to flow after the surrounding surface has set probable causes over application of paint excessive use of thinners incorrect in bracket or lack of like a close curing agent or poor workmanship incorrect curing agent or poor workmanship prevention use correct application techniques and apply at the recommended dry film thickness rust rashing this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide fine spots of rust that appear on a paint film often a thin primer coat the initial spots rapidly spread over the surface resulting in a film of rust through which the individual spots are difficult to discern also from holidays probable causes low film thickness often in combination with the high surface profile prevention ensure that an adequate thickness of a primer coat is applied to cover the surface profile and check that the surface profile is not too large rust spotting this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide individual spots of rust that appear on a paint flame and frequently start as localized spotting but rapidly increase in density 
probable causes low flame thickness more likely creating rust rashing voids and holidays otherwise more likely creating rust rashing but also defects in the steel such as laminations and inclusions too high a surface profile may cause penetration of peaks through a paint film and cause rust spotting may also occur from metallic contamination of a coated surface by grinding dust and so on prevention ensure that an adequate thickness of a primer coat is applied to cover the surface profile use a thicker coating system or a lower blast profile protect coating from contamination with the grinding dust and so on rust staining a light staining on the surface of the paint caused by precipitation of ferrous oxide from adjacent exposed steel this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide probable causes water runoff from a rusty surface above a soundly coated surface rust staining occurs when the rust is wetted out and contaminated water runs over and discolors other items or locations usually more of an eyesore than a defect the coating itself may not be defective only stained prevention ensure adequate design and suitable maintenance next defect is sags this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of this slide sags are caused by downward movement of a coat of paint that appears soon after application and before setting resulting in an uneven area with a thick lower edge they are usually apparent on local areas of a vertical surface and in severe situations may be described as curtains probable causes over application of paint excessive use of thinners incorrect curing agent poor workmanship could in extreme circumstances be a formulation problem prevention use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products settlement this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide the sedimentation of the solid constituents comprising pigments and extenders from the binder and, and solvent while standing in a container settlement that occurs after mixing and during application can result in different shades and performance in different areas probable causes old stock heavily pigmented paint and incorrect formulation of product can be a problem with zinc rich primers prevention use products with within shelf life use adequate mixing procedures keep paint mixed and recirculated during spray application skinning this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide formation of a layer of skin on the paint surface in a container probable causes absence of anti skinning agent use of non airtight container hot storage conditions often occurs in partly used cans prevention use airtight container and store according to data sheet solvent lifting this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide eruption of the surface of the paint film wrinkling and blistering which lead to a weak surface and ultimate coating breakdown probable causes incompatible paint systems used top coats with a strong solvent blend can react with previous and weaker solvent blended coatings over coating before the previous coat has adequately hardened 
prevention use correct coating specification over coating times and materials conduct compatibility trials with undercoat and top coats solvent popping this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide solvent bubbles on the surface of the paint film soon after application probable causes incorrect solvent blends porous surfaces incorrect environmental conditions or high surface temperature prevention use correct coating specifications and materials and ensure correct application techniques and environmental conditions staining this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide discoloration of a coating system probable causes contact with a solid or liquid that imparts a discoloration or stain to the coating prevention avoid contact with solids and liquids that are prone to cause staining or use dark colored coatings where any staining would not be so apparent stress cracking this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of this slide paint coatings with visible cracks which may penetrate down to substrate probable causes stress cracking can be attributed to surface movement aging absorption and desorption of moisture thermal cycling and general lack of flexibility of the coating the thicker the paint film greater the possibility that cracking may occur often occurs around wells and changes in section prevention use correct coating systems application techniques and dry film thicknesses or use a more flexible coating system undercutting this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide visual corrosion beneath the paint film often called creep corrosion travels beneath the paint film and lifts the paint from the substrate severe cases can be can show as blistering flaking cracks and exposed rust probable causes application of paint to corroded substrate rust creep from areas of mechanical damage and missing primer coat can be found in areas of poor design or access where inadequate preparation and coating thickness was applied could also be due to lack of maintenance prevention use adequate coating specifications and maintenance procedures apply a suitably formulated primer wrinkling this defect has been pictorially depicted on the top left side of the slide the development of wrinkles in the paint film during drying probable causes usually due to the initial formation of a surface skin with solvent based paints can arise from over coating before the previous coat has adequately hardened over thickness particularly with all kit coatings prevention use correct coating specification and materials and ensure adequate mixing application and curing by following the paint supplier's recommendations thank you very much for watching and listening this video